Lord Oro's Super Short Stories, Calypso, Chapter 1, The Daring Captain Rainet. Captain Rainet was a brave and adventurous man, who lived in the 1400s. He was known for his daring exploits and his love for sailing across the world with his crew. Rainet and his crew would tell many exciting tales of their travels whenever they reached a shore. His name was famous in many ports, and people would often gather to hear the stories of his adventures. Chapter 2, The Terrible Storm. One night, while Rainet and his crew were sailing through the ocean, they encountered a hurricane. Despite their best efforts, the storm was too strong, and it threw Rainet overboard. The crew tried their best to save him, but the waves were too powerful, and Rainet was soon out of sight. Chapter 3, Stranded on a Beach. Rainet was stranded in the middle of the ocean, with no help in sight. He swam hard to avoid sinking debris and sharks, and eventually found a piece of wood from the ship that was big enough to hang on to. He managed to survive for a long time, but the enormous waves proved too much, and he soon lost consciousness. Chapter 4, The Beautiful Calypso. When Rainet woke up, he found himself on a beautiful beach he had never seen before. He was greeted by the most beautiful woman he had ever seen, named Calypso. Despite not speaking any Latin, Calypso tended to his wounds, and Rainet was soon on the road to recovery. Chapter 5, Falling in Love. As Rainet slowly recovered, he and Calypso fell in love. Despite the language barrier, they communicated through gestures and expressions, and they shared a deep connection. Rainet knew that he had found something special with Calypso, and he was determined to stay with her forever. Chapter 6, The Promise. But one day, Rainet knew he had to go back to his old life. He promised Calypso that he would return, no matter what it took. With a heavy heart, he set out on a small raft, hoping to find his crew in the ship that he had sailed with for so many years. Chapter 7, The Search. For years after the captain found his old mates, Rainet, with the help of his crew, searched for his lost love, Calypso, sailing through stormy weather and treacherous waters. But he never found the place where he had washed ashore. He believed they would be joined once again in the afterlife. Chapter 8, Time After. The day of death was upon Rainet, as he lay frail and weak, his thoughts racing, a memory of Calypso repeating a phrase. Eros, Philia, agape. Rainet repeated the phrase weakly and came to pass. To Raynaud's surprise he awoke in a body of water, instinctively he swam up. Exhausted he managed to make it ashore looking up he realized he was back at the beach where he last saw his love, in the distance a figure made its way toward the captain, blinded by the sun a familiar voice said welcome captain we have much to do.